Hey guys, welcome back to Misha's Corner. Today I'll be making my fried fish with a carrot juice sauce. So yeah, let's get started. So far all I did to my fish was I made some slits with my knife. I just sliced it across with a sharp knife, that's all I did. And I'm gonna season this up with some salt and pepper. Good salt, good pepper all over inside and out. I don't need to bore you guys with all of that. Just make sure you get salt and pepper all over your fish. And then I'm just going to dust the outside with some cornstarch. If you don't have cornstarch, just use some flour. Don't make it a big deal. You could even fry it without it. It's not ne necessary, but I just wanted to use it, so I'm using it. Yeah, and now we're just gonna work on the sauce. All right, now I'm going to start on the sauce. I'm using the Bolt House Farms carrot juice. If you have a juicer, feel free to use your juicer and get your fresh carrot juice. That's totally fine. To this, I'm going to add an inch of ginger that I sliced in half. And I'm also going to add four cloves of garlic. To that, I'm going to add the zest of an orange. Now that I've zested all my orange down in there, then I'm going to add the juice of the orange down in here. And I'm also going to zest my lemon and put the juice of the lemon down in here. So let me just show y'all really quick. You're also going to put the juice of this lemon down in here. Put it on the stove and let it reduce by half. And then we're going to finish it off. Alright, so my cast iron skillet is nice and hot. I'm going to put my fish down in here. And I'm going to fry it on both sides for about... Four to five minutes per size and then we're going to finish up the sauce okay so my sauce reduced and I switched pots as you can see I only have maybe a cup of liquid left which is the carrot juice and now you're just gonna keep whisking in a tablespoon of butter at a time I'm gonna whisk in five tablespoons of butter at this point my stove is completely off but the carrot juice is still hot and you don't want to turn it on if you if you the only reason to turn it on is if the butter is not melting maybe your sauce got too cold before you started whisking your butter in and you're just gonna whisk it in you're also gonna have add some lemon juice down in here and then keep whisking your butter in add salt and pepper and that's it for the sauce this is what the fish looks like right here all I did was put it on the plate I put the sauce underneath my fish and I dressed it up with some lemons and limes. And this right here is just some fried plantains that I fried up in a skillet and tossed it in some fresh parsley. That's all I did to it. You don't have to do it, it's optional, but and yeah, so I hope you enjoyed watching me make this recipe. It's delicious. I like the sauce, it's pretty cool, it's different. It's definitely not something I'm used to, but I enjoyed making it and I like the flavor profile of it. So if you give it a try, tag me and let me know what you think. And I'll see you guys next time on my next video. Okay guys, bye.